Your Excellency, sir, we are very grateful uh, for you being here uh, today, and especially knowing very well that you have had a very busy schedule, and you found time uh, to be with us uh, to inaugurate uh, these very, very important capabilities uh, to allow your soldiers uh, to perform better in various operations. It is through your guidance, Your Excellency, that you have directed that we participate more uh, in helping the uh, areas that have been uh, hit, either by lack of uh, resources like water. And for that reason, uh, we conceptualized the program of developing these capabilities to align with your vision uh, and the Big Four agenda. We are very grateful, uh, Your Excellency, that uh, having contacted our local vehicle assemblers, the Toyota Kenya, uh, Isuzu East Africa, and Mantrak, they were readily uh, amenable uh, to the suggestions that we partner together. One, in terms of procuring the vehicles. Secondly, in terms of developing these vehicles into uh, military standards and working together with engineers from Electrical and Mechanical Engineering Corps, they have been able to give us vehicles that we are very comfortable, Your Excellency, will be able to deliver uh, in the field. We are also very grateful, uh, Your Excellency, that as we were preparing this particular buy, you authorized us uh, to send a quick reaction force in support uh, of the peace efforts in the, diplomatic, uh, in the Democratic Republic of Congo. And I am very pleased to announce to you, Your Excellency, that this team is ready, fully equipped, with every equipment that they require. They have been trained. And I can assure you, Your Excellency, that this team will represent our country to the best uh, standard. Allow me, Your Excellency, uh, to therefore thank uh, the, the managing director uh, of Isuzu Kenya, the managing director of uh, Toyota, and the managing director uh, of Mantrak uh, for agreeing to work with us as partners, uh, partners that uh, are looking at not just profits, but also looking at our national security. I would like to uh, demand uh, now from the commanders that, and the operators and drivers of these vehicles that they take care of them. Uh, because it is only by taking care of this equipment that we'll be able to uh, derive maximum benefits. So it's important that all of us who will be responsible uh, in one way or another uh, with these capabilities that you take care of them uh, because then you'll be able to hand them over uh, from generation to generation. You've heard that the tank uh, came in 1978. That is over 40 years. Uh, most of you were, never, were not born. I had not joined the Defense Forces. And this tank will continue. Uh, and the only way it can continue is through proper care, proper equipment care. So I, I, I urge all of you that uh, will be responsible here that you take care of this equipment. Finally, Your Excellency, uh, I would like to assure Your Excellency that the KDF is fully seized on its mandate and will continue to be seized on its mandate of protection of the sovereignty and the territorial integrity of Kenya and providing defense and security uh, to the Kenyan people. And that defense and security is in all areas uh, that you will be uh, directing us uh, to undertake. With those remarks, Your Excellency, allow me uh, to invite the Cabinet Secretary for Defense uh, to make her remarks and then invite Your Excellency uh, to greet your soldiers and officers. See us, please.